Great, a museum. I hate these places. You are in violation of the COC's general standards regarding coarse or vulgar language. A fine will be deducted from your pay. Further violations will result in larger fines and may result in loss of the COC's seal of approval. The f is that? COC, Comics Obscenity Commission. We uphold the standards of good taste, ensuring comics are a wholesome and instructive form of American family entertainment. Well, aren't you just the cat? Captain Smiley, thank goodness you're here. Uh, did you hear something? Captain Smiley, down here, it's me, Paper Lad. Paper Lad? That's right, Captain. I just came from the diner down the street. I was disguised as a newspaper when I overheard two crooked security guards talking about how Mistress Ropes is going to rob the museum tonight. Disguised as a newspaper? Seriously? Yeah, um, before we go any further here, we're gonna need to discuss payment. Now, we do offer an installment plan, but there is a 35% late fee, I should add. Also, my crime-fighting partner, Origami Kid, has gone missing. Without his power to create representations of objects from paper using geometric folds and crease patterns, I'm sunk as a skunk! So, you pretty much have the powers of a piece of paper. Oh, awesome. We have to stop dilly-dallying. We gotta find Mistress Ropes. Quick, stick me in your pants. What? Oh, nice. Is it just me, or does that kid seem a little, uh, into you? Another fine! Officers, not even the thin blue line of law enforcement can keep women from being granted equal rights in our society. Oh, look at you. Uh, go home and bake us a pie, lady. <laughs> Good one with the pie and the joke and the telly. Laugh while you still can, gentlemen. Once I take the Sappho's crystal with me back to the SS Susan B. Anthony, your era of gender inequality will be over. There she goes with that crazy talk of hers again. Peace. Ooh, stop her before she gives voice to the discontent and frustration felt by women everywhere. Whoa! Whoa! Just use invisible ropes to toss those guards away. Lame! This comic blows! Invisible ropes to control these security guards. Oh, well, don't hit them, man. You're gonna get the fine out of us. Don't have a choice. Plus, it looks like you're doing a great job getting fined all by yourself. Whatever. Just punch and kick. Punch and kick. Fine. Fine. is leaving behind clues to her escape. Guess we're going up. This isn't Detective Comics, so stop trying to be clever. 
Let me also remind you there is a piece of talking paper in your pants. So just shut up and climb! Okay, Toots, step away from the dinosaur. My name is Mistress Rose, you patriarchal jerk. Excuse me, Captain. At what age do you start to notice girls? Whoa, what? Hey, look, kid, now is definitely not the time to discuss this. Excuse me, I'm still standing here. Or are all women invisible to you, Captain? Look, Rose, I know the Silver Age can be a little repressive, but... Don't you think you're taking things a little too far, robbing Chopaz crystals or whatever crappy plan you have going on? How dare you, you men, all a bunch of Neanderthals, ever so appropriate that you should die by the jaws of this prehistoric behemoth! Oh. Whoa, what is that thing, a Velociraptor? No, it's a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Everybody knows that. Yeah, right, be honest. You just read his plaque when a chick was yammering at us, didn't you? No, I was paying attention. So Whatever. I still say it'd be way cooler if it was a Velociraptor. <laughs> this thing such a majestic beast You're doing him a favor how would you like to stand around all day with wires coming out of your ass did that thing just detach his head oh, me. Another time. 